My name is Eric Ernst and I work for the technology department at the Volvo Ocean Race. I'm Port IT Manager. That means I build with a team of five others all the networks in the stopovers and support the uh, racing yachts when they come in with the, all the connectivity we have back to Alicante. And we have a lot of different technology on the boat enabling us to bring the race from the middle of the ocean into people's homes. Over the last 40 years, these races have changed massively in terms of technology. Back when it all started, they had sextants and no GPS. Nowadays, on the boat, we have two satellite domes. One is the Fleet Pro Band 250 and the Fleet Pro Band 500. Now, the 250 we use for sending telemetry data back to race control in Alicante, Spain. Which sends, every 10 seconds, we get a package from every boat telling us exactly where it is, what it's doing, how fast it's going, what the conditions are out there. Additionally, the 250 serves us to communicate with email, to download weather, and we can even send a little bit of uh, bigger media files over it. Um, if the conditions do not permit to send large amount of data, then we switch to the bigger unit, the 500, which is primarily used to send the live HD um, pictures, we can do live X calls, meaning we can do live video calls to the boats wherever they are on the planet. That was impossible uh, not even very long ago. Okay, understood. Counterboarding. The Cobham gear on board, it would be uh, yeah, a very lonely race for us out here with uh, very little information and uh, I think much less interesting for everybody on shore who uh, follows all the footage that comes off the boat. In this edition of the race, well, one of the biggest challenges we had was getting live footage from Cape Horn, which is a very remote place on this planet. We were able to bond two Explorer 710 units together and get over one megabit of upload speed, which gave us the possibility to stream live pictures to our studio in Alicante to create a live show. And that's the same kind of boundaries that you also have at home, which is from where we did it, a pretty amazing achievement. We heavily rely on the electronics on these vessels, um, especially if these vessels get into trouble. One of those systems is the Cobham 6217 VHF radio, which the sailors use to call for help and to communicate with the other boats around them. And this, for instance, was used when Team Vestas Wind hit a reef and Team Alba Medica was able to communicate with them from a far distance um, with an antenna that we have on top of the mast of these boats and was able to assure them that help was coming and assist with the local authorities that were trying to help them. Our partnership with Colbin has been a real game changer in how we plan and approach the race and how we can get the audience to be a real big part of it as well.